In this demonstration, we're going to look at another couple of uh, new mesh tools. The first is improved selection. I'm going to select by distance and just click a point somewhere on the mesh, and you can see it's flood filled out with a brush that's 26 millimeters diameter nearly. I'm just going to reduce that. And what we've always been able to do is to just shift select to add an extra group of points or, or meshes uh, triangles onto that selection what we can do now is to do this continuously so if I select one of them now hold the shift button down now I can effectively paint over the mesh and select a large number of triangles in a single operation I'm going to delete those triangles to leave a very obvious hole in that mesh because what I want to do next is to run the new mesh doctor First, this makes sure that there's no open edges or sort of non-manifold triangles in the mesh itself. And if there are, it repairs those. And you'll see during that process, any internal yellow edges will disappear. We then hit next. And the next stage of fault it's going to look at is a gap fault. And it tells us it's found one. And that becomes highlighted in yellow. And so we can say simply repair that gap using the automatic fix. And that problem has been sorted. So we can now go next. And what it's doing now is to look for holes. And as expected, it's found one large hole. And we can choose how we're going to fill that. So we're going to fill that with a curved surface. And say OK and it will use the curvature of the surrounding triangles to decide how best to fill that region. And then we can say next. And what it's doing now is to detect any self-intersecting triangles. And they also can be dealt with automatically, or in this case, I'm simply going to delete them to leave a hole in the bottom, which I would then fill in using the normal filling tools that are shown in one of the other demonstrations in this series. Once you're happy, you hit finish, and there's your mesh ready to go to the next stage. But as expected, we have this small hole in the bottom where I've deleted some triangles.